Okay, buddy. Okay. There you go, right? Take a note. Well, anyway, well, hey there, people. Um, yeah, this minus 40 degrees Celsius weather is uh, it's no joke. Um, we got another six, seven days of it, so um, since I'm staying in, I decided to do some home renovations or home improvements, whatever you want to call it, and here's some of them. Non-stop project for this guy. Anyway, I'm installing these barn doors in our entranceway here. I already started a little bit. That seems pretty basic. I got this installed. That's ready to go. I just got to level it and make sure everything's straight. Then I can screw that to the floor. Put the doors in. Bing, bang, bada, boom. Mm -hmm. You're all wet. Yuck. They were playing. Of course, I missed it, but... They're pretty gentle. Dogs, I mean, towards the cats. She just loves everybody. Look at her. Let's see the belly. Let's see the belly. Whoosh. Mm -hmm. Let's see the belly. Mm, somebody's playful. Somebody wants to kill the daddy. <laughs> just like that. How easy was that? Might have took me a half hour. I just got to fix the molding a little bit inside the closet and uh, outside the closet. Look at that. Pro. Oh, yeah, I still got to screw this in. Anyway, we'll get it all leveled and uh, we'll be done. Does it work? Oh yeah! Well, anyway, I guess I'm shopping for a couple pieces of baseboard. That piece was there. There used to be a molding that went around this door. I guess I can put that back. Should I put that back? I'm going to put it back just to see what it looks like, but probably not. I'll just get a piece of molding that stops there and it stops there. Yeah, it's just nice and clean this way maybe. I don't know, we'll see. Well, this thing here, that's a tray that goes in, well, it went in the closet, now it's too big. I'm gonna take it out and cut it. Well, because I had to cut this mat, um, there's no lip here obviously, so I raised it a little bit. So I used some old flooring, leftover chunks, and boom. Just like that, almost pro. It's a shame to hide that nice floor. Well, I decided to organize it while I was at it. It's gonna smell good in there when you open the doors there, shall we? Totally gonna smell great. Gonna love the smell of leather. leather. Why do I have so many helmets? All right, that's that's, that's your, we have to have an intervention by the way, Mars, for thing, your addiction to helmets. Thing is, only two of them fit me. <laughs> <laughs> They're all small. Does anybody need a small uh, helmet? <laughs> Get rid of those. Too funny. I'm going to sell your car seats too, shall we? So I'm just going to replace those baseboards. Like That just doesn't make sense. I hate all these baseboards. One day. One step at a time, eh? Your background. That looks great. The baseboards are going to bug me big time. Yep. Got to change them all, fix them all, or whatever. Well, on to the next project. Uh, the tub blew up, it's leaking. So I'm just going to change out the, the whole sink. Because this old sink has a, a carburetor in it. It doesn't work, so. I'm going to just change the whole sink and go back to a regular plumbing. Should be pretty straightforward. I've got to remember that uh, that's probably still alive. i got to go downstairs and shut that off. The breaker, that is. Well, I'm pretty sure the power's off. Wish me luck. 
Awkward. Tight space, man. the carburetor out. Pretty gross. And now to get the sink out. That's pretty straightforward. Yeah. Ready for the new gadgets. I'm just gonna give it a good dab of the silicone and toss the sink into it. Well it's a good thing I tested it. Uh, it doesn't fit. So I'm gonna have to borrow a jigsaw or something to make the hole a bit bigger. Good thing I didn't put the caulking down, eh? Ah, I'm gonna just trim it up a little bit. The half-ass project guy. I still gotta finish this sink. I'm getting a skill saw today. Finish that tonight. Uh, I got my flooring to do the stairs. Shelly picked it up. And I was just about to start priming this. Cleaned all the walls and stuff. Little height. I'm scared of heights. Paint all the way down. Yeah, man. Well, I'm gonna prime it for now. And Shelly will decide on the color, I guess. Hey, right, Cash. Is that exciting, buddy? Is that exciting? I thought we were gonna do the same gray that's on the back wall in this bedroom. Well, the color of this bedroom. Well, I got that wall all cut. Just gotta sand that down a little bit, then I can roll that wall one wall at a time. Well, there we go, I got the one wall done. Um, is it weird that I like doing this stuff? Okay, I'm gonna do this wall and carry on. I had to break out the big boy for the rest. Well, I thought I was done for today. I thought I'd run out of primer, but I found some more in the basement. So yeah, I can carry on. Should have enough with that. It seems to be brand new. That was left behind from the old owners, I guess. Carry on. Well, I made it to the end. I stretched it out a bit. It got a bit thinner as I went, but got her done. Uh, another project in the near future, I'll be pulling out this rug and doing this all the way down. Then, in the future, future, this is basement floor. I'm thinking of doing an epoxy on it. Epoxy with some kind of a pattern to it. Well, I've got my color to paint this, so we're going to do that today. Today is the next day from yesterday. 
Oh yeah, I'll get this painted. Well, after I'm done painting this, hopefully my neighbor Kiefer finds his uh, jigsaw. Yeah, I asked for, like I said, I asked for a skill, if he had a skill saw. I have a skill saw, but I kind of want to fine tune it with a, a jigsaw. And then, <laughs> I'm going to tackle these stairs. So, I'm having a tiny bit of issue with this flooring here. Um, when we installed this flooring in the kitchen, um, well, our plan was to put caps on the stairs, right? Like pre-made caps. But we decided to go just with the flooring all the way down and on the back. Thing is, uh, Steven, my buddy Steven had cut this, so there's no click to this, so I can't click and continue. So, like this has been like this for a while now. And in the meantime, like walking by, walking by, the floor got damaged right here. So in order to replace this whole piece, I gotta rip out the, the floor all the way to the cupboards there. Up to here. Either that, hmm, I wish there was an easier way, <clears throat> I wonder here, no, it's pretty damaged right there, eh? I have to take this whole piece out, I wonder if I can just cut it square out, cut another piece square in and glue it half ass, uh, I'm going to end up pulling at it, can't be that bad, eh? <laughs> Alright, first things first, let's paint these walls. Well, anyway, half-assed guy here ran out of paint. So I was working with less than three-quarter of a can because we used it in the spare bedroom. So I gotta go buy some ceiling paint anyway tomorrow. And I'll just get another gallon of that. Whatever color that is. Can you get to your water, buddy? There's water downstairs for now. Can you get it? Hold on, I'll help. Let's go. You can get around that. Let's go see. Come on, buddy. Go. Go that way. Come on. Scoochie scoochie. Oh, you're scared of it, that's why. So after that, <laughs> it never stops. I should paint these walls. It's just primer. That's okay. Another time. And I came up with a plan for this part here. Instead of ripping out all the floor, I'm just going to cut along here. Pull this whole piece out. Then I'll get a whole brand new piece and I'll cut the click clicks out. Then I'll cut it to shape to fit. I bought some construction adhesive, so that should do the trick. This way, if I cut these off, it'll be nice and square. It's hard to cut square with uh, an X-Acto knife. This vinyl flooring is pretty, pretty tough. But yeah, so that'll go. I'll be able to add a click floor to it, cut that, then do my stairs. And I got some metal end caps or whatever, whatever you want to call those. Uh, yeah. Oh shit, I still gotta paint that. That's the shelf that goes down there. And the sink's still not installed. It's too late. It's, yeah, it's way too late to start making noise. At least painting's quiet. Well, these are my painting buddies. I just throw those on and listen to tunes and paint away. As far as this stuff, I'm just going to grab uh, grocery bags, put them in grocery bags, and uh, throw them in the freezer. That way they'll still be fresh for tomorrow. Well, it's another day. I'm at it again. Um, I didn't get my paint for this area yet. I'm going to go in a bit, and I tackled this on here. Um, I think it's going to work out. I'm just going to trim it and throw it in there. thing is, there's uh, three locking points in, so it's going to be a little, a little tricky to get it locked. Anyway, we'll figure that out. We'll have stairs done in no time. Well, I got more paint. Um, I'm all done this. I uh, just got to hang up the mirror. I'll play with the baseboards a little bit. For for some reason I lost one of those, I don't know. But yeah. Got Johnny back up. He looks good there. He looks good anywhere. So nice and clean, eh? We can this door here. Well, I'm gonna wait till 
the spring. We're going to paint it a different color. It's going to have to be a metal color, so you don't want the door all froze up like that. But yeah. So I got this part of the floor all fixed up. It wasn't as bad as I thought it was. It's still clicked in and whatnot. So probably tomorrow I'll do the rest. Easy sailing from here. Look how nice. Eh? Yeah, it's going to look sharp. These baseboards, I got to cut them. They don't fit anymore. I hate those baseboards, man. I hate them. What's going on, buddy? Oh, there's my jacket. It's snowing. It's uh, minus 20 now. It's warming up a bit. So I caulked all the edges. It's all caulked. I keep saying this, but this will get done uh, tomorrow. I'm going to do this and the stairs tomorrow. I just cleaned up my basement too. Look at it. Doesn't take long, eh? Anyhow, um, these things here, uh, that's what I got for the stairs. Uh, Shelly picked them up. Well, they offered to cut it for Shelly. And I said, nah, I'll do it. I don't know, I wasn't thinking. I don't have anything to cut it with. I should have let them. Anyway, I got on the phone a couple days ago and I asked them, uh, are you still willing to do that? And Buddy said, no. So, I don't know, I guess because Shelly's a female, eh? So this guy here, he kind of scared me the other day. He was in the hospital and stuff. Um, his son, Jack, just released something on, well, I seen it on Facebook saying that he's feeling much better, so. The Prince of Darkness. Well, that's enough renovations for today. Uh, thanks a lot for watching. I really do appreciate it. Big, big cheers. And we'll talk to you guys later.